Anderson in the backfield on the right hip of Hastings. Now in motion. Hastings throws on third down. It's dropped. He had Samuel Batu open for what would have been a first down, and instead, UC Davis will punt here on the opening drop. Yes, sir, they're kind of the same. Very dual threat and run this offense identically. Five taking a shot. It's caught into UC Davis territory. Sawyer Rockinelli with a great fight. Five survey steps up, going to tuck and run for the first down across the 30. It's safely out of bounds. This is empty set on a third and six. You see Davis sends three, wide open, busted coverage. Montana touchdown. It opens the scoring here in Missoula. Montana really spreads the field, and you're thinking, okay, they're going to run the ball, run the ball. It actually looked like the defense wide open. What a start for the Grizz here at home for the first time since October. Hastings throwing off his back foot, setting up the screen. Biggest play of the day for UC Davis. Finally getting something going in the screen game. And I like what they're simple, trying to find high percentage plays. There's one to Larison out of the backfield. That's a first down for UC Davis into Montana territory. It's a coordinator at the time. Second and one, hands it off to Mateo Perez. He storms forward for a first down right to the 20. So they could name the head coach here. Probably wouldn't happen. Hastings rolling right in trouble. Throws on the run. Right on the money. Knocked out of bounds inside the five. Trent Topkins held on to make the catch. Great job. Just getting Miles Hastings out of the pocket there. Nice throw on the run. Outside part of the field. Touchdown! Some trickery on the play design, and it pays off for you. Misdirection, Jay. Everyone's eyeballs are on Land Larson. You think it's going to be a handoff across the way? It's a little flip. Everybody was going to the left, and the ball came back to the right. That was fantastic. And all eyes are on Larison, one of the best players. Third and three. Five. Good protection, steps up, lets it rip, and it's dropped. That is tight end, Cole Grossman, wide open. And Meyer came up and made a great open field tack. Got all of that. Third and long, Montana sends for Hastings, gets rid of it. Well short of the sticks. Jackson Lee, the move for a yacht. It is Grizzlies offense, empty set. UC Davis sends three, throwing high in the air, and it's incomplete. Junior Bergen. Crowd continues to be loud and proud. Hastings throwing, risky pass, and it's batted down. Krishan Gordon read it well in the secondary, and you slip more time for Gordon to get down there. Well, that was a drive to forget for UC Davis. Couple, three penalties, almost an interception, and then a bad punt out of bounds. Montana's playing some of his best football of the year. Grizzlies start with the football. A yacht got rid of it, a risky pass, had to get rid of it on third and nine. And Montana. Keep it on the ground, second and four. Larison churning those legs for a UC Davis first down. They can get the throw to him, they'll get some Wildcat quarterback in. Throwing on first down out of a play action, it is caught Samuel Batu for a big gain of 17. And I like the balance on this drive. Give the ball to Larison a couple times. Okay, we're. They run it with Jordan Fisher, his first carry, and he gets three to move the chains. Gutsy run by the sophomore running back. This thing to pick up this first down. Third and five, Montana sends pressure. Hastings, very poised. 
throws it right on the money for a UC David. Made a key block and made that play be successful. Play action. Hastings on the run. Risky pass, but it's caught. Stacy Dobbins, the freshman wide ball game like this. Pressure comes. Hastings gets rid of it. But the Montana defense delivers. They had the ball all the way. Not too much win tonight here in Missoula, but Ridley trying to connect from 42. And he just sneaks it in. But UC Davis takes the lead. Play action. Pass is caught. Bouncing outside. A first down and more for Junior Bergen. Finally shoved out of bounds at the 50. Quick struck confident in both guys. Both guys are going to play. We've seen both of them. Here's Gilman. Finds a hole. Hits it. Inside the 25. That is what Eli Gilman can do. Biggest game. And they feed it to Oswell, trying to rumble forward to move the chains. This will be right at the line. Fife on third down, steps up, throws to the end zone. It's intercepted. Picked off in the end zone by Rex Connors. Timeout on the field. What a play by the junior safety. And you can see Logan Fife frustrated. Got a safety, Rex Connors, middle of the field. Thank you very much. You run it right there. I'm going to pick it. Ten. To stop the clock with 2.30. So two-minute timeout. We'll step aside. Third and seven upcoming for UC Davis. Aggies lead by three. Drive punt, bounces at the 50. And Bergen can't even get his hands on it. So Montana safety comes down with him. They gotta be careful there. To a third and six, just trying to keep the drive alive, and they do. Fife delivers into UC Davis territory. Drew Deck left in his first half. All three timeouts left for Montana. I don't like that. Fife on third and four throws, and the pass is caught. There's a flag out as well. No, he went out of bounds. Pass is why. Yeah. Offense. The receiver went out of bounds on his own, came back in, and was first to touch the pass. Fife, it is Grizz offense. Empty set. Five surveys. Nobody open. Hockey gave him a lot of time. And that pass is knocked down. Incomplete. Rex Connors again. The ball hawk. He's been. It is UC Davis Santa. offense to go to work. I would have liked to see the punt there. They run it with Larison. Turns the corner. Gets out of bounds. Just past the 50. Done well to hold Larison in check until then. They run it again. Larris in a first down. That'll stop the clock momentarily. But big yards. Wilson already five tackles tonight. Hastings throwing. It and it's caught. Winston Williams, great job after that ball was tipped to hang on a gain of nine. Direct snap to land Larison. Reverses it to Hastings. This is the quarterback. Some trickery. Throws it back to Larison. Well defended by Montana in his first half. Trying to add to a three-point lead. Miles Hastings loads up, fires to the end zone, and that pass is incomplete. Keon left. So you see Davis will settle for a 41-yard field goal attempt. And Hunter Ridley drills it to finish this first half. You see Davis. A 13 to 7 lead. The fun first half out in Big Sky Country. That's the end of the but first half. Football on this crazy college football Saturday. We should have a fun second half in store for you. 
But a good return here to start the second half. Montana all the way past the 50. So great starting field position at the beginning of this second half. Montana sticking with Logan Five for quarterback. That pass is incomplete. Flag comes in. Pass interference. Junior Bergen. 23 in the defense. Spot foul. First down. So Baines trying to left, two to his right. Rolling left, pressure coming, throws off his back foot, and that pass is incomplete. Bounced it right in front of Drew Deck. Fourth and eight upcoming. In the playoff at the FCS level since the 1980s. So that's old hat at this level. There's wrapped up. Trevin Gradney. No gain. What a stop on third and one. How about the fifth year senior? Alter Cruz punting out of his own end zone. Junior Bergen lets it bounce, and this will be great starting field position for Montana once how they approach the quarterback position. Critical third and nine for the freshman Ayat. Sets up the screen. Osmo has blockers. Has the first down for Montana. That's what this Grizz offense has been looking for. Empty set. Bayat, good pocket, steps up, throws, passes caught for a Montana first down, back-to-back -back quarterback out of Hawaii. Bayat sees running right up the middle, stays on his feet, powering forward, all the way extending to the pylon, and he's in! Touchdown, Montana! Down. Did Kaylee Ayat break the plane? Hands it off to Osmo, and he swallowed up a loss of three. Jackson Cloyd, three at second in goal from the four. Ayat keeping it himself. And he's stuffed again. Third and goal upcoming. David Meyer. Look at him go. Goes under center. Moves a man in motion. Rolls right. Ayah. Gonna try and tie it. And it is. Touchdown, Montana. The right call. We have a. Fast quarterback down and center in the field, give him a run pass option, doesn't like the pass, but boom, goes Superman into the end zone for the touchdown. Montana takes the lead on their USA, number one steer wrestler, and he shows off the ability to make it happen there. Third and three, first down UC Davis, they get it through the air. Trent Hopkins, the former quarterback, first half, UC Davis immediately answered with a touchdown drive of their own, trying to do the same here. High throw, but it's caught. Stacy Dobbins went up and grabbed it. Flag comes in for a face mask. Personal foul, face mask, number 37 of the defense. 15-yard penalty. That's huge. Face mask on the landing. Ball moved all the way to the Montana 30. Hastings back pedals. Now steps up, throws over the middle. Pass is caught. Winston Williams wrestled down at the 25. You see Davis moving the ball very effectively on this drive. Subbing. Hastings goes under center. Gets the snap off. Play action. Throws wide open. It's caught. Simpson, touchdown, UC Davis. Everything goes this way right here with the offense. But then they bring Simpson back. He leaks out late. They don't see him. He scores a touchdown. To their own end zone. Can they pick up the first down? Ayat trying to do it himself. Trying to push that pile. Not going to get there. Stuffed. Gang tackled, and the UC Davis defense delivers. Set to punch it away for Montana. 
With a minute 20 remaining in this third quarter. Perez lets it bounce. And it goes out of bounds right around the 40. The game starts to break through. They're trying to establish it here. Right on cue, Jordan Fisher gains a first down. Play action, Hastings rolling right, tosses it. Caught by Samuel Batu. And he has stopped just play of his tenure. And Len Larison is lined up for a direct snap. He takes it, charges forward, needing two yards, pushing that pile. He's got it. Len Larison delivers. Hold on a second. Illegal substitution on the defense. 12 players on the field. Five-yard penalty results in a first down. I'm First down for UC Davis. Play action, Hastings throws it. Some trickery, and it pays off. Caught at the 15, inside the 10. C.J. Hutton threw it, the wide receiver on the field. So they actually are not gonna review this. First and goal, Lan Larison runs up the middle. Inside the five, wrestled down at the one. I think you're gonna see the same thing again here, no? Hastings goes under center. Rolls right, tosses to Larison. Touchdown, UC Davis. Hastings to Larison, the dynamic duo, the veterans of this team come through in the clutch. Montana's defense packs it in. A great play call by Tim Plow. Going with the play action. I like going for it there because you go for it, you get it, you, you take the crowd out of this thing. And then they get the, What's going on there? What are they setting up for? And they said, hey, we play at 1 o'clock. Came on back and got a little action. That pass is intercepted. It is all UC Davis right now. First throw of the drive. And the Aggies have it. Porter Connors, the linebacker, read it beautifully. And it is all Aggies at the fourth. And a yacht forced that one. There's two gold helmets in the vicinity. Connors, both Connors. It was Porter Connors and Rex Connors in coverage. And for him tonight, which is a career high. Hastings, pump fakes, then throws, passes caught. Chaz Davis, the reception for another UC Davis first down. And the Aggies right back in the red zone. And they run it on third and 21. Not going anywhere. And Montana holding UC Davis to a field goal attempt. Even if the Aggies make it, it stays a two-score two game. game. It would be a 16-point lead. So he forces you back and stalls the drive. Hunter Ridley has connected from 42 yards and 41 yards today. This from 40. And he puts it right through. So his third field goal. He didn't see him, and now it's third and 12. A yacht throws risky pass after he was intercepted on the previous drive. Montana's offense. Ty Morrison punts it from his own five-yard line. Perez lets it bounce out of bounds at the 50. And this will be excellent starting field position for a UC Davis team. All right in the run game. Third and seven. Hastings lets it fly. Risky pass, and it's batted away. Trying to pick out. Steps up, throws, and it's caught. Five put it right on the money to Junior Berg in a gain of 30. Most experience in, in, in this moment in the game, this situation, game on the line, you want the guy who's played a lot more football. Redshirt Junior steps up, throws, passes caught. Great grab. Went up high to bring it in. Keeler, the injured yep. white. That's right. Third and ten. Montana needs it. Fife 
wrestled down. Made for here. Five hit as he released it. Ball falls incomplete. Turnover on downs. Down and taking their time. They are an up tempo team. They go right back to Larison. He picks up the first down into Montana territory. That's his 29. Third and five, UC Davis decides to throw the ball. Winston Williams dropped it. I don't know why you driving him back. Throwing, pass is caught. Aaron Fonts, who's been quiet in this second half, gains 20 there. UC Davis defense. A yacht off his back foot, and that pass is incomplete. And it's just been that kind of night offensively for Montana. Never found a the offense is going to roll tonight. Just weren't able to do it. Pressure coming on fourth down. A yacht throws it incomplete. Turnover on downs. And UC Davis is one for go toe to toe with a great team in a harsh environment and come out with a solid victory. Big confidence booter for Tim Plow in his first year as head coach. And speaking with 60, he thought last year was it. He was, it. was gonna move on, work commercial real estate. When they named a new head coach, Tim Plow, the man who recruited him, back when Plow was the offensive coordinator, said, let's, let's give it one more go. And this go is now nine straight wins, nine and one for UC Davis, a road win against Montana. It's the Grizzlies' first loss at a home night game since before 2018. They had won it 11 in a row before tonight. And Tim Blau told us yesterday, he, that's his goal as a coach, is to build a program the way Bobby Houck has built this Montana program. And this is a statement win for Tim Plow and this entire UC Davis team.